I go? Yes. Lionfish are small fish with poisonous spines on their bodies. Um, they have stripes all along their body. Uh, that's how they got their name, lionfish. Um, they're native to reefs in the Indo-Pacific, but they have found their way to warm oceans worldwide. Um, lionfish belong to the scorpion fish family. The, yeah. And in that family inc include approximately 500 species. The problem is, is that lionfish are multiplying by the minute because lionfish can have up to 2 million eggs per year and they are eating all of the small fish in like the reef areas like the coral reef in California. They're eating all the fish that live in those areas and coral reefs are dying because of that. And if we do not stop them in um, I think a show I watched it said like 20 to 40 years, every coral, or the coral reef in California will be dead. Pretty much, so there'll be no coral reef left. Jessica, like it. Some solutions we found were um, find a predator that predator that can eat the lionfish and like they eat it. Um, killing them will not only stop the invasion, but it'll still it'll save over seventy species of fish. And another way we can stop it is start eating the lionfish. The effects on li or biodiversity. Lionfish are eating the fish that live in like the coral, which I said in the first one, but which will eventually kill the coral, and this includes the reef too. Imagine this place dead, which would mean that it's white, and like the coral bleaches itself pretty much when it dies, and it... Like, no fish will live there anymore. And then that would mean that, that, that there's no Nemo there. Mr. Wampler, yep. will you click the lionfish, please? We link the video to it. Yeah, I did it. One of the solutions is that we didn't get to put on was um, 
we would be able to, like, either us, like, there are certain seasons, or there's, like, certain seasons you can fish for these lionfish. In some areas, they are protected because they're getting rid of eels, which are also harming the ecosystems. But if, like, there was a certain number of how many, like, let's say Congress was to pass something, or other areas where it's affecting, like, Cal oops, California was to pass a law saying that you could hunt lionfish all the time, or, um, like, no. there are certain seasons, like, in some areas, sometimes you cannot fish for them, but you can, or, like, yeah. But if they pass the law, I feel like more people would do, like, would fish for them. And then if they were allowed shop, fish shops to uh, actually serve them, some fish shops don't want to serve them just because they're too lazy and they don't know how to prepare them. If some people were to know, like who knew how to prepare them, were to go through and teach fish shops how to prepare them, they would probably prepare those and multiple people would start catching them just because they can make money off of them. Um, Alright, what's up? Oh, there's over 10 million lionfish in that specific area. There's over 10 million lionfish. They've been here for 30, or that video said that they've been there for 10, 10 million years. 13 years just because people were irresponsible and threw them out. Just because they didn't want them. That's like 26 Mason? Uh, exactly how large can these uh, fish grow? Mm -hmm. That big? About that big, but their spines stick out. Because their spines on the sides of the man on the top stick out about this much. That's most of their size. It's harmful to humans and other fish. Okay. So, what are the ways that, like, um, people have to prepare the fish? Like, why are they too late? Just because you have to cut off the um, spines, and you have to be very careful when cutting them off, because you could stick yourself with the spines, and then the poison sac inside the fish, I think it's in its stomach. If you rupture that, you can't do anything with the fish, because it ruins the fish pretty much.